to season three episode two of the two manager project and despite pre-season predictions being royal wood and bassett a to fight against relegation and b to only finish 15th after five games they're unbeaten not only are they unbeaten they've never lost they've won five games in a row if we look at the schedule look at that as you can see our last game that you saw us the opening game of the season was 4-1 win away at AFC Porchester, but since then it's a 2-1 win at Blackfield at home, an away win 2-1 to Odeby. Corkery's a team that he went to from us and of course came back from, beat Wroxham 2-0, beat Walton Casuals 2-0, who at the time were top. So the interesting thing about this is, if you look, out of those five games, we've only conceded three goals, which is fantastic. Today's game is up against Felix Stowe, which we're away at. Felix Stowe is sitting second literally beneath us so this will be an interesting one they've had five uh, three wins and uh two draws so i'd be curious to see how we get on against them okay if we take a look at hales owen now they're sat in third but joint 16 points with the top three there um all of us have won five drawn one and lost one um if we have a quick look at the fixtures you'll see that uh you saw our two new win against salisbury we had a disappointing one nil loss away to bedford um, but we followed that up with three straight wins with Hitchens, St. Neots, and Stratford. The two all draw with Martin and Tiptree was a was an interesting one. I felt like we should have done better, and and I take responsibility for that one myself. But the uh, goes back to winning ways with the Stourbridge game. So today we're away against Colville. Colville are tenth. Whoops, in the league. Here we go. There we go. So. Uh, yeah, fancy our chances. They've lost four. Won three and lost four. No draws. In fact, they're the only team in the division to not draw any yet. So, uh, given how we're doing, uh, I fancy our chances. Wooten Bassett of Felix Stowe. Todd in goal for Bassett. I don't think you've seen him play yet. He missed the first game, but uh, he's not done too badly. He's only played two games and managed to clean sheet. Uh, one clean sheet, even. Um, but Curtis Meir has... I've rotated the two because Curtis Meir's performance has been great. Um, back four, Smalley, Cabani, Collins and Pursehouse. Midfield on the left, Garner, Farrell and Demby in the centre with Barker on the right. And up front, it's Corkery and Fisher. As you can see, Fisher, our top scorer. Scorer? Scorer. And uh, Corkery, along with Demby, highest average rating. Billy Cartwright says to uh, challenge the team to pick up where they left off. So that is what I am going to do. Let's be assertive about it as well. Okay, kick off. Royal Wooden Bassett in the blue with the yellow socks. And uh, Felix Stowe in the red and white striped top with the black shorts and red socks. Bassett to take the kick off. Um, yeah, this is far beyond what I was expecting. Oh, Mackenzie Lye, I think that was. Corkery now. Puts it out wide to Garner. Garner with the ball. Looking for the cross in. Denby's there. Fisher. It's 1-0 to Royal Wooden Bassett. That's his fifth goal of the season. Proper poacher's goal. Be in the right place at the right time. There we go. Corkery puts out wide for Garner. Garner puts a nice cross in. Denby has a go. Controls it. But Fisher, he's there. Make sure he goes in the net. Good result. Good result. Good goal. Okay. 1-0 up. Here we go again. Corkery on the ball. Out to Smalley. Smalley now. Bringing it forward with Garner with the cut in. Demby puts it out wide to Smalley again. Smalley with the cross. Cut out by the defender only as far as Garner. Demby now. Demby's goal. That's 2-0. That's his third goal of the season. I think his previous two were by free kick. But uh, clearly he's enjoying himself. Look at that. Garner to Demby. Nicely placed. Well, that's not bad, is it? Not even eight minutes and we're 2-0 up. Two shots. Two on target. You know what? Let's uh, let's get creative. Persehouse pushing it forward to Fisher. Cut out by the defender. Hendricks now for Felix Stowe. His pass cut out. Demby now on the ball. Farrell 
Long ball forward. Cut out by the defender, but Fisher picks it up. Puts a cross into Corkery. Mackenzie Lyle, he claims it. Long ball forward. Again, cut out. Barker this time picks it up for Bassett with a long ball forward. Cut out by the defence. Well, oh. Vermi, he's through. One-on-one -on -one with Todd. Saved. He had about four uh, Bassett defenders around him, but uh, at least he got a run in. Corner now. Youngs for Felix, though. Curls it in. Onto the head of Dusby, was that? I didn't see. Disubi. There we go. Okay, Ainsley now to Desubi. Oh, it's picked up by Smalley for Bassett. What's he going to do? Puts it out to Garner. Garner on the wing. Long ball for Fisher. Fisher's on it. Oh, my goodness. 3-0. That's his sixth goal of the season. I didn't actually mention this, but again, people are for, out for Tom Fisher. Um, an offer was made, and 49 teams have him listed as their target, so... Chances are I can give him a proper contract, which means we'll at least get to keep him for the rest of the season if it gets too hairy. But, I mean, he's enjoying his football and doing well. I don't know why he'd leave. We're top. Okay, Farrell now. To Garner. To Corkery. Corkery's in the crowd, puts it back to Garner. Garner's got Smalley running by him. Farrell now. Through the middle, back out to Garner. There's Smalley with the cross in. Fisher. Just wide. Yeah, Fisher's not bad with his head, but he's not the tallest of guys. I haven't got him as the main target for uh, corners or anything like that. Coming up to half time. They've had a lot more shots now, 15. They're just not making them count. Well, I'm very happy with how things are going. And I'm going to say so. I'm very happy with how things are going. There you go. Looking at that, I don't think there's anybody I need to think about bringing off just yet. Farrell's not totally, totally fit at 81. But we'll see. We'll see how to get on. Felix Stowe. Grant just taking the kickoff. So yeah, again, another strong performance by Bassett. It's just been... It's weird. I'm I'm in a division higher than the Hellenic Premier, but you know what? Bassett just feels like a better team. The way they've just been out playing everybody. I mean, five games unbeaten in a new division is is pretty rare, especially for a team that doesn't spend any money. Oh dear. Clark pushed Charlie Barker, did he? Oh, I see Fisher with the penalty. Oh, it's saved. Goodness gracious! Ainsley now for Felix Stowe, giving it legs. Yeah, not a great ball forward there. Smalley cuts it out. And a fairly pacey pass back there to Todd. Todd with the kick forward. Only as far as the Felix Stowe team. Vernie now. Reed. They're looking to advance. Vernie made a bit of a run, but didn't want to get offside. Hendricks. Hendricks to Reed. He's on the edge of the box. Take shot. Clark. It's a goal for Alex Clark. Okay, come on, boys. Demand more. Don't want to be taking too many of them. It's only 67 minutes. Just passing it around. And there was Clark. Picked up the rebound. Well, I'm going to go cautious. Just to be on the safe side. Here we go. Throwing from Smalley. Farrell now. Just at the edge of the box. Smalley with the cross in. Headed out by the keeper. Reed now makes a run for Felix Stowe. He's got a striker in front of him. He has a shot, but it was wide. Corner now for Felix Stowe. Youngs curls it in. Picked up by Todd. No problem. Well done, Todd. Coming up to the 80th minute. Long ball forward by Todd. Felix Stowe again on the attack. Reed. Out wide to Dusby. Dusubi, sorry. It's hard to read on here. Hendricks. Reed. Youngs. Out wide now. Cross in. Clark looking for a second. Young's now on the edge of the box, trying to find some players in space. Young's takes a shot. It's a goal kick. It looked like you took a deflection off the keeper, but you know what? Let's show some passion. Last, last minute, last three minutes. Here we go. That's it. Todd with the goal kick. 
Nice you lot. Well done, Bassett. Three one. I am very pleased. We don't need to say anything specific. I'm just going to say well done, lads, because that was good. Hales Owen now, away at Colville. In goal, we have Folks with a back four of Straker, Marshall, Beckett, and Alfieri. Jack Finch in defensive midfield with Augustine in central midfield. Attacking midfield left on the wing, we've got Jennings, Eaton Collins in the middle, and Mr. White out on the right with James Roberts up front. The reason why I'm going to mention Mr. Mike White, he's a youth player, and uh, one of those I thought, meh, he's not very good, I'm not going to bother with him. He ended up getting a game, scored two in his first game, got a second game, scored one in that. So over the space of two games, he's got three goals with an average rating of eight. So I'm going to give him another go. He seems to be doing very well. Um, and I think the uh, couple of games and stuff like that will be good for him. Um, but it was just one of those guys that's come out of nowhere and done something good. So, yeah, he's keeping people out of the team at the moment with his performances. Okay, we're ready to kick off. Yep, pick up where he left off because it was a good result. You know what, I'm going to let the, let the assistant manager do that. Here we go. Kick off. Hale Zoen in the blue, Colville in the uh, white with black shorts and stripy socks. Oh, and stripy front of the kit too. Interesting. Okay, well, let's start with a get creative and see how we get along. Okay, Doyle Charles with a free kick. Gregory now, and they've scored. Colville are 1-0 up off a free kick. It wasn't a bad one, but yeah, Doyle Charles... Long one over the top. Gregory's completely unmarked. Oh dear, how's that? That's not good. Let's demand more. Oh, here we go. Jennings with the corner of Hales Owen. As far as Beckett. Beckett puts it in. Callum Beckett's first goal. Here we go. Nice one. Beckett gets to it. He's tall, got good jump and reach, but terrible heading, unfortunately. So it kind of hits his head and goes wherever it wants. But we'll take that as equaliser. Come on, boys, we need a bit more than that. I'm going to push forward, see if we can get one one more before the half. That would be perfect. We are struggling a bit. We've had three sh oh, we've had three shots on, two on target. Better at a possession, but uh, don't know. Not taking our chances. Yeah, it was disappointing. I am not happy with your performance. Okay, who are the problem people? I actually feel like I need to do something different with the tactics. The control possession works great a lot of the time, but I do have to swap back to good old-fashioned Gagan press just sometimes. Make sure I include my play for set pieces in there. We'll play it into space for now. I don't always like to do that, but here we go. All right, Hales Owen, let's get creative. I want more out of you. I'm going to give you until 65 minutes and then start making changes. I think Roberts needs to come off now, to be honest with you. And in fact, I'm going to do that. Tell you something that I tried the other day, and I'm very, very tempted to do it again with Jason Law here, is I went strikerless. Oops. So I moved Law over. Had one so, uh, shadow striker. There we go. And an advanced playmaker on support. Yeah, I couldn't do that, could I, last time either. Tech and midfielder on support. There you go. That'll do. Um, there's something else I wanted to do. I'm umming too much. Striker with the throwing now. Finch on the edge of the box for Hale Zoen. Augustian back to Finch. Looking to find somebody in space. Augustian to Law. Law kills it, but a bit too wide there, mate. We actually need to take off, pass into space, and we should use that and work the ball into the box and be more expressive. There you go. Check the analysis, make sure there's nothing important. I already did that. There we go. Otley has it for Colville. Pass back. 
Long ball forward. Law now for Bassett. Puts one forward for White to chase. Gets his cross in. There's Jennings. 2-1 to Hells Owen. What did I tell you about White? That's one of these things. That you keep finding these absolute stars just that I keep leaving to rot away in the youth team. But look at that. Great work. And, of course, Jennings, my son, my first signing, I think, uh, when I first joined the club. He's uh, starting out well. Okay. Do you know what? I wouldn't mind another one of those. Feel free to keep going. Langley with a free kick for Colville. Putting it forward. Wow, they got people to chase. Beadle. Well saved there by folks. Diaz now. Fouled. Come on, striker. I think I'm just going to demand more. They got the free kick. It's put in. McMa McManus. Nope. Oh, dear. What did you do, folks? Is that the same McManus who used to be at Bista? I'm going to have to go have a look in a minute when it comes up. Okay. Colville free kick. Free kick corner. Nothing came of it. Donnelly Blackburn to pick it up. Oh, Beckett gets on the end. I'm just going to pause this a minute. McManus. No. Scott McManus. Not the same McManus. I'm going to check his history. Just been, yeah. It's not the same guy. Carry on, fellas. Well, we're still 2-1 up. Okay. Otley with the throw in. Straker clears that one. Otley with the cross now. Eaton Collins on the ball. Nice run forward. He's got support left of him. Ah, not a great through ball. Not a great pass. I wonder if I should actually put passing space back on because he might have put a good through ball then. White now to Augustian. Eaton Collins. Law. Look at that. Oh, it's been disallowed. He was offside. That's a shame. That was a nice bit of work there. Again, strikerless, you note. McManus had a free kick. Oh, my goodness. They've equalized. It's two all. 84th minute. Remember how I complained about those equalizers in the 85th minute? <laughs> Here's one. Okay. I'm going to make you guys go on attacking. And I'm tempted. Oops. Come on, boys. Push forward. Caswell for the goal kick with Colville. Only got about three minutes left. Only as far as Augustian. He's up there for Jennings to chase. Gregory picks it up, though, for Colville. That was a pass back and a half. Augustian now with Bassett looking... Uh, not Bassett. Good God with Hells Owen White out on the right. Alfieri. Tackled. Tried to run through him. Okay, they're looking for the through ball, but Marshall picks it up. Back to Folks. I think that's... Well, we've got a couple of minutes. Come on, Marshall. Straker. Augustian. Finch now. Alfieri. White. Then progressing forward. Out to Straker. Straker with the cross. No. Nope. Rebounds. He's going to take a throw in now. Okay, time's running out, boys. Let's make this count. Straker with the long throw to Jennings, who flicks it on, but it's cleared by Colville. As far as Diaz, he's now on the attack. Shimalo picks the ball up for Colville. Cross cut out, but he gets a second chance at it. Donnelly Blackburn. Scott now. Nope. Jennings pushing back now with Hells Owen. Eaton Collins put one foot forward for Law to chase. Law. Oh, my goodness. Is it allowed? Yes, it's there. 3 2 to Hales Owen. 93rd and a half minute. I hate I hate being on the conceit again to those, but that was nice. Look at that lovely ball from Eaton Collins to Lord of Chase. He's not super quick, but he got on it and made it count. Placed well. Good job, Law. I think that's our three points. Straker now. This must be it. Eaton Collins. Augustian. They clearly don't. They don't seem to be as passionate. Jennings. To White. Oh, dear. Well, they got a corner out of it. I don't think they're going to let us take it, though, at 95 minutes. Augustian. No. Wowzers. That was a great game. I really enjoyed that. Good result. Good result for Hells. I mean, good comeback at the end there. Gagan Press for the win. I've said it before. I haven't needed to use Gagan Press every match. Um, sometimes I always use 
direct counterattack. It just depends on what's happening in the flow of games. And if I can't get any tweaking to work with the uh, possession, then that's what I do. Anyway, well done, boys. Fantastic result. I am very happy. So let's just finish up with a quick review. Bassett, of course, winning away 3-1 to Felix Stowe. Holding on to the top spot, that's six games. Played 6-1-6. Six, six. And uh, with a goal difference of plus 11. It's not bad. Not bad at all. Like I say, it just seems... The way we've played seems that we're not overpowered per se, but just a, a better, more co cohesive team perhaps. But yeah, could not be happier with that start. I would like to keep that level of form up. I mean, obviously Moneyfields and Melksham there are doing quite well. And I mean, Felix Stowe, who we just beat weren't doing badly so yeah good job Bassett let's pop over to manager two at Hales Owen and there we go top 19 points played eight one six closest to us is St Neots um, but that's it's all a bit tight up there because we're on 19 points St Neots on 17 but the next three teams are on 16 points so it's all still very tight but like I say it's eight games good god we've got another 30 odd to go yet so uh but yeah good signs of early form both teams winning their matches very nice if you enjoyed that please do give me a thumbs up and subscribe for more football manager videos thank you very much for watching